Hey everybody, it's Mark again, and I've been asked to do a video set for a cuckoo clock for beginners, taking you from step one all the way to the end. So uh, I've been thinking about what to do during this video set, and so um, we're going to go over a lot of things. Um, we're going to go over uh, tools, uh, a little bit of history behind cuckoo clocks. Uh, I'm going to show you uh, uh, different types of uh, clocks, um, different types of uh, movements. I'm going to uh, take you from... Step A all the way to Step Z, hopefully, uh, during this video set. I'm going to make up a folder in my YouTube channel that says Cuckoo Clock Repair for Beginners. And so if you're a subscriber to my channel, look for that folder. And as I make videos... For this set, I will put them in that folder. I will use some videos that I've already made. And there's no sense in me making um, videos on how to um, uh, repair bellows when I already have, <clears throat> excuse me, when I already have videos out there. I do have uh, some uh, different kind of glue. Um, I might try that d during this video set, but um, we're going to talk about a lot of things. And uh, the first thing that I will tell you is I am not an expert on cuckoo clock history. Unless there's providence, meaning... There's a date on the clock. There's a manufacturer on the clock. You have paperwork in hand from showing the history of that clock, when it was per made, when it was purchased, etc. I personally feel that the, the antique cuckoo clock makers and... They're sitting up in heaven laughing at us, be, um, talking to themselves, saying, you know, maybe we should have put our name and our dates on the uh, clocks and on the movements. And so uh, I'm the admin for two different groups. One group is called Collections, Antique and Vintage of All Sorts but mainly wind up clocks. And I'm also the admin for a group that I inherited from a friend of mine who asked me to take it over on his deathbed. This group is uh, strictly about cuckoo clocks and all things Black Forest UK. And so uh, if you want to join those uh, groups on Facebook, uh, I will put the links in this video. You have to answer the questions. If you aren't able to answer the questions, more than likely you will not get approved to be in those groups. Um, uh, the groups are slowly um, um, gaining more group members, and that's because... We are not allowing uh, automatic approval in the groups. Um, so, um, anyway, the reason why I mention that in both my groups, my Black Forest group expert, Valentin Weber, is German, lives in Germany, and if I have a question on a cuckoo clock, I ask him. 
again, I'm not an expert on the history of the making of clocks. I will point out during this video set some web pages that you can uh, uh, check out. Um, but uh, we're going to talk about several things. I hope y'all stay tuned. I hope y'all hit that subscribe button. I do this to help people out. And uh, I've never asked any of my group members that I video chat with for one dime. So uh, I will get paid when YouTube gets their requirements. Um, so uh, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that notification button, leave me some comments, and uh, and uh, stick with this. Uh, between us, we might learn a few things.